No. Always. Is it? Yeah. I might be on YouTube. You're going to be on YouTube. What's your name? Jake. Jake. Yeah, yeah. Where are you from, Jake? Gilderson. Hilkeston. No, Gilderson down road. All oh, right. Okay. Right, anyway, right, we'll sir. crack on. See you I later. I'll tell you what you did, you saved me a day, a lot of petrol. Do you know the uh, splash, the water splash? Yeah. Yeah? I we were going to go down to have a look at it and I it went down closed. a couple of times, I got some good drone footage and I got some good views and whatnot. And then it come to a Sunday and I thought, well, you go down on Sunday, I wonder if I catch him there. Uh. Yeah, and I just went through videos. I went on to, um, night before I was going to set off, I went on to YouTube. And you and saw you me video in them oh, coppers. Yeah, you said, oh, it's all been walked up, it's been walked, it's stopped. I yeah. thought, shit. I thought, I'm glad I looked at that because I'd have gone all the way down there and it'd have been shut. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I bet there were a lot of people did that. I bet there were a lot of people did that. All right, Steve, see you later, mate. Okay, so we're at uh, IKEA, but it's not the IKEA shop, it's the, it's the warehouse. And. Uh, I don't know, I, I don't know if it's a... Oh, it says private property of XL Joinery, no parking. I don't think it is. I don't see how they can say that when they've got... Um, they've got other companies on the same road. So... But never mind. We'll just plod on. So it looks like this is the IKEA warehouse. It looks like this is where uh, all the stuff that you buy comes in and then gets transferred from here into the store. Or can you come here and collect? I don't know. Oh, welcome to IKEA Leeds Click and Collect. There you go. So you can collect from here. So we've got an external warehouse. Right, let's have a look around the side, see if we can see anything around the side. Now, unless we've got ridges coming in here, we're going to have a lot of problem getting Arctic in, especially with public parking there. It's going to be really, really difficult. Right, let's go and have a look around the side, shall we? So there's a lot more to this IKEA place than just the, the store that you go into. There's quite a bit more all around the back that you don't you don't normally get a chance to see. Oh, this is nothing here, just a bit of a dead end. And what have we got here? I think this is still uh, IKEA here. Now then, something of interest here worth looking at. I did talk about these on um, on the Young's Frozen Food Place when I was talking about the trailers and fork trucks going on onto the back of trailers and how um, they can put a support under the front end of the trailer so that if a fork truck comes right up to the front end it's not going to tip up. Now it just gives, not that it's likely to tip up anyway, but it just gives that extra support to, um, to the trailer legs. So you've got your wheels at the back taking the weight, then you've got the trailer legs, and then you've got this at the front, this yellow thing at the front. And you put it underneath and you wind that handle up, 
see if I can get a better look at it yet. You wind that handle up, which uh, holds the front of the trailer up. TS2000 trailer stand. And it goes from 42 and a half inch to 55 and a half inch. 1.08 to 1.41 meters. So there you go. That's what that's all about. I like the way they've got the signs on the back. So, some of the normal way around and some are mirrored. And they've got a brake seal point. So you back up there. You get the back end of the vehicle in that box. And then you can break the seal on your, on your trailer. Now the seals are there to make sure that you're not going on the back of the truck and nicking out out of it. That's what the seals are there for. All right, let's have a look a bit further down. See what we can see, if anything. Now, this looks a bit more interesting. All right, then. Hey, buddy. How are you doing? What are you? Ah, uh, you know. So, do you do home deliveries for IKEA? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Non stop, mate. Non stop? Non stop. I don't know. So is that people that's ordered over internet or people that buy in shop or both? Well, it could be both. All right. It could be both, yeah, yeah. So what we do is we take all stuff up there, unload it, and then it gets dis distributed. Oh, so you're only taking it up there? Yeah, we only take it up road. Literally, our, our depot's literally behind IKEA. Can you get sorted into the roof to come out tomorrow? Uh, you what, sorry? Can you get sorted up to the roof and goes tomorrow? Oh, right, they'll go out tomorrow? Yeah, so whatever people's pay for today will be out tomorrow. Well, you've got a steady run then, haven't you? Yeah, it's all right. I bet it's exhausting driving all that distance, isn't it? Yeah. Some days, mate, we can get off at 6 o'clock and not come back till 8 o'clock. Is it that busy? Yeah, busy, mate, non-stop, very busy. Well, I don't know. I, what surprises me is they let a terrorist organisation sell stuff in this country. I'm on about Al Qaeda, mate, not IKEA, you are right. Personally, don't bother me until I get blown up, mate, I'm alright. Well, as long as you get paid, that's all that matters. Yeah, exactly. How come you've got a GoPro? I make YouTube videos. Oh, do you, yeah? Yeah, so I'm, I'm just doing a video about IKEA and having a look around IKEA. Is it recording now? Always. Is it? Am I going to be on YouTube? You're going to be on YouTube. What's your name? Jake. Jake. Where are you from, Jay? Gilderson. Hilkiston? No, Gilderson down the road. All oh, right, okay. Oh, I forget, boy. I didn't want to walk on the thing. What's your YouTube name? What's my YouTube name? Yeah, let's have a look before you go. Before you go. Oh, I'll take that. Can I keep that? Yeah, go on to your mate. Yeah, yeah. yeah, do you want one then? Oh, oh, you got a key ring? Yeah, we love a good key ring. There you oh, go. Well. So you got YouTube name, yeah? Yeah, that's my YouTube name. 800 nod videos. Yeah. Well, I'll have a look when I'm... Don't forget, you got to subscribe, though. I'll subscribe, don't worry. All right, mate. Right, cheers, buddy. See you later. Have a good one. You too, mate. So there you go. <laughs> All they do is drive from here, up there, where I've just um, parked the car, unload it, and then come back again. You'd think they'd be better off with a little electric vehicle doing it, wouldn't you? We've got the returns department here and pick-up area. Temporary parking spaces for collection only, it says there. And there's a multi-storey car park for the actual store. I don't know if you can get in the store this way or not. Right, so that's about it for IKEA. And a bit of a chat. Had a look at a trailer stand, and that's about it, I'm afraid. Anyway, if the video's been any good, please give it a thumbs up, please share, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.